Vermont Senator Bernie Sanders, one of the Democratic Party's candidates for the 2016 presidential election, has yet to take a definitive stance on cannabis, despite 73% of U.S. liberals supporting the plant's legalization, according to Gallup. In an interview with Katie Couric on Yahoo News, Sanders said cannabis isn't for him. Quote, I smoked marijuana twice, didn't quite work for me. It's not my thing, but it is the thing of a whole lot of people. Like Hillary Clinton, Sanders doesn't consider cannabis law reform a top issue and wants to wait and see what happens in states that have already legalized cannabis. In a Reddit interview, Sanders said, Colorado has led the effort toward legalizing marijuana and I'm going to watch very closely to see the pluses and minuses of what they have done. However, during a recent trip to Colorado, Sanders hinted that he would be talking more about cannabis law reform in the future. Quote, it's something that we are going to look at. We will be talking about this issue. As a Canadian citizen, I can't vote in the U.S. election. But if I could, Bernie Sanders would have my support, despite his somewhat disappointing stance on cannabis. When he announced he was running for president, many people assumed Sanders wasn't a serious candidate. But poll numbers and speech turnouts have proven them wrong. Compared to Hillary Clinton and the clown car of Republican candidates, Sanders is the most honest, transparent, and progressive candidate running in next year's election. Based on his views on things like income inequality and free college tuition, I have little doubt that Sanders will become an ally of the cannabis movement when he looks more into the issue. Even though Rand Paul has already shown leadership in cannabis reform, it's difficult to fully support a candidate with backwards views on many other issues, like abortion, immigration, and healthcare. However, with a year to go, there's still a lot of time for voters and observers from other nations to pick a candidate they support.